That's crazy. Now, what, you you mentioned before you and uh, you and Guru used to sing. Was there a point where there was a crossroads? Like, yo, should we be an R and B group? Actually, nah, because we thought we were the first dudes that could come as like singing and rapping. Yeah. But like, I was so deep in the street. You know what I mean? It's yeah. Like, like he, he he was the son of the judge, you know, so he right. was going home. They had a baby grand piano in the living room. It was chill. I was going back to Mattapan, but my pops, you know, was, uh, you know, on some alcoholic shit right then. And I had to, like, keep, you know, hustling and doing what I was doing. Yeah. So we would get together to win these talent shows. We would win mad talent shows and get money. Yeah. But I'd take my cake and, you know, uh, bounce, and he'll take his shit, go somewhere, yeah. and then we'll get up later. So, yeah. you know what I mean? But, um... If, if we stayed together from the beginning and didn't get separated, we probably would have came out like that. You know what I mean? But uh, the adrenaline, too, like when I'm doing a show, the people, man, they make you want to just, like, give the big show show. You know, you want to rap. You want to do it like with freestyle. I bring my man Singapore on, and, you know, he do his little thing, you know, and then I'll just break into some songs. Sometimes I even do something fly because there's a chick in the front. Mm -hmm. And I'll be like, yo, you look like you might not really know nothing about hip-hop. And then I'll break into, like, some singing yeah, smooth yeah, shit, yeah. and they be all like, you know what I mean? <laughs> and then after every show, when I do the ending, the gospel ending I do, the a cappella, like, the, the the chairs and the 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 clap and everything and the applause is crazy. Yeah. You know, it's funny too because I did one show where they really didn't probably know the records because they had just came out on my last album, and it was in New York in SOBs in New York. You know, they serious about that, but they some new shook, some didn't. Mm -hmm. So they heard the joints, they was bopping, giving it up, and then when I just you know blessed them with that outro, you know, then everybody in there, you know, what I'm saying whether they knew me or not, they all yeah. just was like going off, and then they want to tell you. Yeah, you know, oh, damn, man. you got talent, man. You yeah. know, like, I, I, it's not like I'm asking you that. I'm just saying when Gangstar, the light was shining bright, you know, dudes that weren't really focusing as much as they should have, you know, on what I what I could do and what I had to do. I mean, that's what money was doing. You know, everybody, you know, giving money, get whatever. But I always wanted to come out. I should have probably been out 10 years ago on that level, you know. Mm -hmm. But, you know, I'm still here. I'm still blessed. You know what I mean? I'm not locked down. I'm not dead. For all my friends that did pass and get caught up and all that, I'm still here repping them. And I'm repping kids and adults and the over 35 circuit. They all, like, step to me and know yeah. something about what I've done. You know what I mean? So it's crazy. You know what I mean?